Okay, well I'm back to working with the Slayer Exciter and uh, this is uh, Slayer007 uh, his YouTube channel is GBluer all the information is there also at the Energetic Forum um, you'll have to track it down if you go to the Energetic Forum but uh, go to his YouTube site and uh, you can see his videos on this and why this is very interesting to me is how this does what it does especially this particular circuit right here he has basically got a Tesla switch thing going on here. He's driving it with a one AA battery cell phone charger. He's running the exciter. Then he's picking up the energy coming back to this source in that AA battery and charging that. Now, I've got the AA battery right here that's going to be charging while this is driving off of another AA battery through a voltage bumper. It's a cell phone charger that bumps the one and a half up to a five volts to run the Slayer Exciter. And this is uh, his latest setup that I've tried to replicate here as close as I can with what I had. It's pretty phenomenal. It, it really is. And let me turn this on. And as soon as I turn this on, I'm going to connect this right here. Watch the voltage on this battery, which is this battery right here. Watch this bump. There it goes. Now, this is being charged, and I've run several tests, and that's actually charging that right there. Now, it doesn't mean that I'm gaining anything here. I think all that's happening is I'm just drawing energy uh, out and through and depositing it over here. I don't know. My other experiments with these Tesla switches uh, were not uh, that impressive, but we'll run some more tests on this one and see how it works. But uh, it's running this uh, exciter now, and uh, let's see if I can get this to go correctly. There it goes. And there's the big fluorescent tube right there on. And uh, this is uh, pretty phenomenal. This is off of one AA battery, and it's uh, the voltage is being bumped and then bumped with these uh, coils here and then uh, excited uh, with the uh, exciter. It's a very, uh, very interesting, very uh, fascinating thing to study, these exciters. Of course, it started with Dr. Stifler's SEC exciters, and we just picked up the term exciter. We didn't mean any offense to the doctor. It's just the term that uh, seemed to apply because this whole environment gets excited around these things. And it's, uh, it's an excited environment. And that's why the name stuck. And like I say, it, it might mean no offense to Dr. Stifler. It's, uh, all of his circuits are patented and all that. But uh, this exciting of the environment around this circuit is very, very interesting. And uh, this Slayer Exciter uh, is one of the more interesting things I've studied because of how it does what it does. And you can see this battery is now up uh, showing there. Now I'm going to disconnect this and show the resting voltage on that battery. Now if I load that for a period of time, I'll be able to test and see how much energy was actually recovered during those uh, few minutes that we ran into that. And then of course you can calculate how much uh, energy is being drawn out of that too. Uh, this cell phone charger actually um, uses a lot. It pumps out uh, three to 500 milliamps. It's, it uses a lot, believe it or not, to bump that voltage up. It's not very efficient. So what I've been using um, mainly is one of these um, battery packs here that I can uh, put out about five volts too. And I can get a better read on how much power is actually being used, but you can see this this came down a little bit, but it wasn't where it was before. So anyway, I just want to share that with people that this uh, this latest thing that Slayer has uh, come up with, um, I'm impressed with it. Uh, he's doing some phenomenal work, and like I say, it's Slayer 007. Go to his uh, YouTube site, G Bloor, and study this latest circuit. This is a very interesting uh, circuit. Thanks for watching.